Howdy folks, Zelgrex here, welcome back to Motorsport Manager. And today, our home race, track, uh, race 9, here at Milan, 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 Milan. Uh, we have our new driver, Kylie Hui, Kylie Hui, I'm going to go with Hui, uh, currently sitting 21st. <laughs> um, we have Frankie sitting 10th in the championship right now. I think that means uh, uh, Hui is going to be on the front row of the grid to start with. So that's interesting. Um, yeah, I did have to uh, adjust a couple of parts because uh, uh, Kylie uh, believes uh, should have a, a, a more even car. Um, and Kylie is going to be our, our primary driver moving forward. Um, we are going to slowly move away from pay drivers. And what we're really looking to do here, and what we have done so far, is we're looking for um, young drivers who we can train up to become our future stars. Um, we're going to do it this way around. Um, this will ensure we get money from Bjorn. Uh, Kylie is going to drive on race day. Uh, interesting <laughs> speed balance here going in opposite directions so uh, I think we leave that pretty much in the middle looks like handling wants to go smidge to the right downforce wants to go smidge to the left so we're gonna go a little bit left with the downforce just a touch right here and we'll keep the speed balance around here for now um, We're gonna try running on the softs, I think. We'll go a little bit this way. A little bit this way. Maybe a little bit that way. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna try this on the softs this time. And we're not expecting to get anything above level one right now because we still don't have good feedback on our drivers. Um, we are contemplating trying to bring in uh, Alex Rogers from BMR to be a, a new test driver for us. Wow, great, great, great from the start. That's pretty nice. <clears throat> 93%. Uh, okay, so we do a minor tweak. Let's just do something like this and something like... Uh, let's do, something, let's do uh, something like this. And you can go out, do a, a three lap run. Okay, here, looks like we went too far. Downforce is perfect though, so we're happy. Uh, and we know it, we're gonna clap our hands. Let's think. We're gonna try something like this and see if that gives us a, a good setup. And I'm still gonna let her run a, a full three laps. Again, I, I still we're not we're not gonna be able to um, we're not gonna be able to, to get a uh, a level two I don't think but we can try so uh, oh yeah so Kenny's the one ahead so we'll stick with watching Kenny for now we just want to know when people are coming into pit really 15 17 that that feels about right 15 18 that feels even more right. Uh, looks like we've made some improvements, so that's good. Here's Frankie. Frankie already had excellent uh, got really hit. knowledge level one. So we've got excellent poor good. Weird. Um, so we were okay there, and we're poor there. So we actually need the handling to come this way. It's unexpected. We were uh, okay there, good there. Okay, we're going to try this. Um, well, have you come back in. Excellent, good, good. I feel like that's worse than we had. Did we start graveyard right? Yeah. So we went the wrong way. The uh, well, that's easy enough. So we want to go left, which means like that, and then like that. Yep. Yep. That should be lovely. Uh, 
you can go out on new set. Go out, do three laps. Off you go. You're, I think you're set. We may be able to sneak. May. Doing one lap here with Kenny. And then we're going to have her go out on a, a full run as well. Excellent. Good grip. Significant increase. Up to a 93. So, okay, four, good. Have we gone too far? We might have done. Go there. Okay, good. Let's go there. And then we'll just do the best composite of, of all of the options. Okay, run to the end, please. Yeah, we're not going to get to level two here. We've been staying out the whole time. Bjorn's happy with the setup, that's good. Gear ratios are good. Uh, Kinney is going to be able to get one more lap in here, so that's what we want to see. Uh, this is Bjorn's last lap. Finishes 19th. And Kinney finishes 18th, so very, very discouraging. <laughs> Apparently our car is not built for this track. <clears throat> yes, John. The name is good. The car currently not so good. It's okay, Frankie. We'll be fine. This is the first race that Bjorn is not going to be in the driving seat. Oh, we did get to level 2. I didn't even see that. Oh, that's great. 10% boost instead of 5%. Lovely doubling. Uh, how do we finish up here? 97 most weeks were good yes you are going to run on soft gonna have six laps and then over here frankie oh dear so we were poor good and we're still good and we actually got worse than we did here so i think we need to be like here-ish Something like there is probably as good as we're going to get. Uh, yep, you're going to be on soft, you're going to be full. Um, and yeah, since we're set up like this, what we're going to do is we'll go this way around. Um, and you can actually push at the beginning. Uh, you can just go to push. Uh, and in fact, I'll even give you high just for a little bit here. Yep, as predicted sitting first on the grid, which is nice. That's why we're, we're actually giving a little bit of uh, attack here. And way better off the line than the Predator here. Frankie currently sitting in 12th. Uh, I didn't check the weather, but currently looks like it's going to stay clear. Okay, we can already back on this now. Mainly just wanted to get away well. Um, you know, we've got to last six laps on this tank, so. Uh, but I mean, already three seconds ahead of, of Frankie, just because, um, just because we uh, started in a better position. It's, it just goes to show how important grid position is, because uh, that will sort of get amplified across the, the race up to three and a half second gap now. Uh, and you can see Hui is uh, backing up the field here, giving Costa a nice runaway. Uh, definitely going to pull back on the tires here and here. And you know, Kylie is going to drop, oh, I say that, uh, Sabato just crashed. Uh, sadly, tell you what, a safety car there would have been perfect. Alas. Not to be. That's okay. 
Not gonna sweat it too much. Uh, we are still looking good on dryness. Yeah, tracks still predicted to just keep getting better. Okay, I'm gonna just crank up the speed a smidge. Just watch as our car drifts down the field. <laughs> Uh, we will do a check of fuel as we come around this time. And uh, I think the tires are probably holding up for now. So across the line here, 3.1 will stay on on the medium here for now. Kenny uh, has just gone past. Uh, it's going to be a little tight for Frankie, but I think we're going to be okay. So for now we just, un until, unless there's something that dramatically changes, uh, and you can see now we are 18th and 19th. <clears throat> um, unless something changes, uh, we, we stick with this plan. Yeah, it's getting sunny, so we're, we should be fine. Um, yeah. So, uh, wow, already got folks pitting here. Uh, including Evans, who took a really long stop there. <laughs> so 15th and 16th, and okay. So uh, Hui is going to pit next lap. You can go to high. Keep nursing your tires. You are going to conserve your tires because you've got two more laps to make, Frankie. We jump way up in the standings now. We would really like this 400,000, let me tell you. And we're confident again, in fairness. Uh, we were not confident of getting a top one or two spot in there, so I think we made the right choice in just being conservative. Um, so if we is pitting, we'll have enough fuel, so that's good. We're going to stay on the soft. On the medium. I think we were on the medium. Uh, God, didn't I check? We're now going to follow Kinney and make sure that she can get around one more lap. I think, we've given the uh, the fuel economy of the, the engine, yeah, look at that, no problem. Uh, yes, we will pit soon. Uh, you're still backing them up for now. Yeah, everything's fine. We can do most of this lap on the medium, actually. So we will. And then... We, will, we should have put her on the mediums, uh, on reflection. Okay, that uh, looked like a clean stop. It was. You now go to safety mode. And let's schedule this pit before I forget. Come back out on soft. Oh, oh, oh. lovely. This strategy is fast, okay. Can he currently in the lead? Uh, cars in bad shape. Currently scheduled. <laughs> I'm just gonna come it down just a smidge so we don't run out. Just a little concerned about that. Still looking dry. Uh, no, you cannot attack a bit more. Clean, clean, clean so far. In goes the fuel. We are getting the full six laps, which we needed to have. We didn't get that. That would have been bad. Uh, you now go to medium and push. And you should be good for the rest of the race. So, actually came out behind Hui. Um, that uh, last lap, I think, really hurt. And already we're getting the excess fuel message. Um, we will... Let's push now while we have an empty track ahead of us. We're going to go all the way up to overtake here. That excess fuel is going to disappear pretty quick. There we go. Uh, but we are going to keep burning hard when we can. Because now is the time to do it. Ooh, like to see that pit stop with repairs. Uh, this is people's second pits, so we obviously want to be overtaking everyone coming out of the pits now. And those who are making their second stops, we are well clear of. So that's good. Tires are holding up well for both. And we can actually pull these ones down a little. We're going to push a little here. 
to try and bring the temperature up. We don't want to drop all the way down. We do have excess fuel again. I'm just going to go to high for a little bit. Uh, especially on this nice long flowy section. Um, yeah, two stoppers are about 13 seconds back. Well, those ha having made their second stop, I should say. Uh, so Rogers is going to be one of those who needs to make stops. I'm not worried about him being right behind us here. We come up. Uh, no one making their second stop for this lap, but I think we're going to see a lot here. We um, 25 seconds off the lead. That might be enough for them to get in and out. So realistically, I think we're we're definitely not looking to come in, in the top couple here, but certainly top ten. Uh, we need to pull back off this. I just realized I hadn't really been paying attention to that, but I think we'll be fine. Yep, yeah, already getting excess fuel, so definitely good. Uh, tires, uh, let's just go back to conserving those for a bit. And yeah, you can see whole gaggle of folks in the pits here as we come past. And that is. Uh, sixth and eighth. So now we just need to hold position. Uh, oh, there's still people who haven't pitted. Uh, we can we could get on the podium here actually, because I don't I don't think anyone else I don't think the AI is is, is one stopping. Um, I really don't. So I think I think we're in a position where we can afford it. We did just lose that position. Uh, not surprising that is to uh, championship leader Petra Shoba. I wish that the last race of the season was a um, was a 13 lap because I think it's double points for the last race. That would be amazing. But go away, don't need that. Thank you. Uh, okay, yeah, second, third after the pit stops there. Um, Cavalcanti is only three seconds back though, so certainly can't rest on our laurels here. Last couple of laps though, tires are holding well. We'll go ahead and I think we can safely push up here now looks like Frankie might be able to get past here uh, yeah here they come I did not take them long they're now two seconds back they're on pressure tires um, it's honestly to be expected we're gonna we're gonna drop some places here um, if it comes to it I'll, I'll wait till we get closer but if if Frankie can get past uh, we then I will encourage that yeah, we lost, lost the spot there. Gonna, oh, okay, we're actually fine. You're gonna... You might lose the <laughs> place anyway because you're running out of fuel. Um, tires are holding okay. We're gonna lose fifth now. Dropping off the podium any second. Um, I mean, you know, obviously full fifth is still gonna be very, very good for us. If we can, if we can hold it. Uh, oh, we're getting excess fuel for both now. Lovely. That's what good fuel efficiency does. Is he going to hold it? Is he going to hold it? No, he just lost the podium. Oh, I'm so sad. I don't think... I mean, yes, technically we, we had 0 .09 left, but it would have been risky to try and push that a little bit harder. Um, I'm happy with where we finished there. That's good. Kenny's tires are starting to look real bad at the end there. But this should secure us minimum six may even be enough to uh, give us fifth even if we have a relatively mediocre race for the final one of the season uh, let's see what, what happens I mean there's always a chance that we can get on the podium because of illegal parts too so we don't no illegal parts anywhere or at least none found uh, but obviously it's a huge race for us uh, Bjorn is in 13th uh, obviously uh, Kylie is going to be last to be expected. Uh, Frankie moves up to ninth, which is, is very nice. Uh, yep, we do indeed go up to fifth, and all of a sudden, hey, look, we have a chance at fourth again. I don't think we're going to compete with Vexar. If, the, if it was another 13 lap race, next race, then yes, we would be competing here for um, for fourth. Realistically, I think we're finishing sixth. Uh, I think we're all but guaranteed. Uh, I don't. Yeah, I think we're pretty much guaranteed to finish ahead of Archer here. Um, 
but yeah, if, if again, if it's a 13 lap race, I think we could have it, but it's not. So I don't think we're going to. I think we're going to finish in the teens. And that'll put us, you know, lower than we'd like. But it's okay. Okay, and this is nice. We're seeing development here. Not a fitness. Uh, it does have that issue, though. Um, the the cookbook or whatever it was so that's uh, I think affecting his uh, standing right now we came third everybody's happy marketability goes up which is what you want to see uh, we only lost 193 so that's something um, so from the drivers we still made 215 so you can see we got paid a lot basically uh, that's very good news really good yeah so we're still balancing the books quite nicely with the drivers there um, and eventually we may just move Frankie into that reserve spot once we secure a better uh, young like a, a young up-and-comer again like uh, like uh, Kylie uh, that would be nice so let's see do we have any good picker uh, I can tell you no. Nope. Uh, I can tell you no. Nope. Uh, I can tell you no. Nope. Okay, only above 90. Uh, unfortunately, tires with neither of these means no, nope, despite the 96. Uh, good tires, but not good refueling or anything else, so no. Nope. You can front jack, but that's it, so no. Nope. Okay. Rotate. Uh, Amos needs to come out here at 84, I think. Uh, Amos needs to stay in at 84. Okay, that's just the way it worked out. Uh, currently at 10.6, so uh, Del Olmo to the rear jack. Uh, Francesconi is not a tire person, he's a front jack. Okay, better. Uh, Di Natale, doesn't matter where. Uh, Amos, are you better front or back? Are you better front? Uh, Ugolini, are you better in back? No, not really. Uh, Di Natale, are you? You're pretty much the same either way. Uh, but that would be a, a net loss, so I think we're gonna have to just stick here unfortunately I mean I could bring uh, Cassidy instead of someone here Say instead of Amos that pro probably makes sense Nope Oh, because you're refueling I mean you're, you're yeah, no I did not make sense exactly. Uh, Ring being key for any of us. It's only a two difference and way better on tires and refuel. Uh, we do have a couple point ones. Kind of feels unavoidable right now. Okay, cars being repaired. We'll take the interview. Um. I'll just butter her up. Uh, okay, hurt their morale a little bit. Oh, okay, I would love to have Petra on my team. She's a great driver. Okay, we did some pit stops and the brakes have been built. Okay, so let's allegedly fit the part. We're not fitting that part, it's illegal. We don't want to lose it. Uh, we can't go to improve parts until now. Now we can improve parts. So we need to get that into this as well. Um, that gearbox is probably the best for now. So let's do that. So we have just a couple points here. I think we just go ahead and we finish up everything here and then we'll circle back around to see what else we need to do. Got some more scouting done. I'm not at the moment. People I'm scouting are sort of like way down the road. You know, they're they're sort of three, four stars, whatever. Wait, what was that? I'm done. Oh, he's about to retire. Really, not a problem. Um, hey, marketability's good, but he's about to retire.
He's got like a week and then he's out. Uh, I'm not too concerned about that because he's my backup driver. So, performance work is done. Uh, let's just look. Do we have anything? Oh, those really active, those bright ones. Gosh. I'm not going to improve them, I don't think. Uh, Let's look at it here because, okay, you get back in. Those top two, top two, this is one of the top two, uh, top two, top two. Okay, that's all of our best parts being, uh, all the best parts being currently improved. And then we have uh, stuff being reliability, uh, honestly. Let's go like this. And we'll just top off all the reliability real quick on some of these pieces. Uh, we can get this done before the end of the season, so everything will be everything will be done. I don't think we're designing any more parts at this point, so we're good. <clears throat> Arguably, I could try to design like one more front wing, maybe. Um, that's a that's a possibility. Okay, here we go. Uh, yep, there it goes. He's gone. By Bjorn. Uh, reliability work is done. We can't be sitting fifth. He's happy. We've got a race coming up. Okay. Wow, everything's done. Uh, I guess we do this. And this. And. I mean, I. But, Wow, that's surprising. We'll go like here. <clears throat> now let's just double check, make sure no one else has suddenly emerged. Someone has emerged. Another 17 year old. Perfect. Oh, very bad feedback. Could be, could be good. Could be good. Ooh. Very good. Very good uh, drivers there. Probably, probably too good for us, really. Yeah. Uh, hopefully, we will get uh, a bunch more after the last race. You know, beginning of the next season. Anyway. Yeah, factory staff are idle because we've literally. Yeah, no. Frankie, I'm with you. Ken's gotta go. Frankie Parks is garbage, but is a pay driver. Hello. Not interested. Oh. We need Frankie to get uh, fired. How is Frankie, with these stats, getting second? Bonkers. Absolutely bonkers. Um, 297. Wow. Uh, would be nice to have in the fold. Uh, reliability work is complete. Okay, so we've literally we've done everything that was worth doing. Every part on both cars is as good as it can be for the final race. I mean, you can't say fairer than that. All of our future parts, I mean, we might as well just work on the reliability of some of these. I don't know if it matters. Like, legit, I don't know. I guess we'll find out. I don't think it does, personally. Because I think you actually get new parts that are just based on your previous best. So, um, <clears throat> so come to the final race of the season. Maybe we'll get lucky and we'll make a bit of money here. I don't think so. Something like 12th seems more likely. Everyone's happy with their parts. So, uh, we'll come back here for the final race of the season in Russia, Sochi. Um, and next one might be a little bit longer because we're going to have the postseason wrap up in there and everything. Um, and we'll sort of juggle. We've got sponsors to deal with, we've got uh, new designers to try and figure out. Um, 
we may even go through all of the preseason as well. Um, just kind of depends on how quickly everything goes. But uh, for now, thank you very much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.